everyone, welcome back to Digital Assets Daily. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, wherever you are in your corner of the world. Zenfin Delegated Proof of Stake XD POS announcing major network update. Zenfin's update on its XD POS consensus protocol will go live in the upcoming days. And what is XD POS? It's an innovative solution that solves the scalability problem in Ethereum blockchain and other blockchain-based platforms relying on a 108 master node system that has XD POS consensus and the innovative technology supports fast a two second transaction confirmation time. So XD POS also leverages innovative techniques like staking via smart contracts, true randomization and double validation to guarantee stability, security and chain finality. So Zenfin's XD POS system is interoperable with EVM compatible which is the Ethereum virtual machine compatible protocols, smart contracts, and cross-chain token transfers. One thing too, I want to kind of point out in the next article, Monetigo provides the first ever global solution to duplicate financing fraud and trade finance. And why this is significant is that on the ITFA, the members are also Monetigo and Zenfin as well. And then Atul Kikade, uh, you know, on his LinkedIn states, I led formation of the first production blockchain network valued at nearly 100 million for a consortium of Indian banks and financial institutions for fraud prevention and trade finance industry. And what is Enfin focused on? Trade finance. So this is also the first live production blockchain network in the world that is fully legal and compliant with laws of the land and is actively used in day to day life. Swift is currently piloting on this network. So the Monetigo connects right to the CEO of Zenfin as well. And here in the more recent article, exclusive swift launches double financing fraud solution pilot with monetico and again if you're interested in these articles they are available in the description below of every single video also too i want to mention i know we did on twitter but the sbi acquired dow dow exchange in japan and relist xrp so here comes the pound relist xrp and the domino effect as they start falling and everyone starts to relist again as we begin to near the ending of this case and they start to get clarity i believe you know ripple would have done it alone but i believe now together teamed up not that they are partnered up but in the sense of now they're on the same side of this battle against the sec but ripple with coinbase i believe is going to be a significant stack of uh, lawyers or attorneys however you want to word it and like David Schwartz said, our attorneys have good words. So I think of that every time I think of anything now connecting to the Ripple um, lawsuit, because now Coinbase is directly involved. Not the same suit, but now they're under the same attack. So it's going to get very interesting. And I believe, you know, Congress may just step in and and give us the clarity they're looking for and as retail investors that we are looking for as well today was just kind of just crazy so i'm not getting into that we had a discussion early on that so either which way guys just remember this is not financial advice it's for entertainment purposes only and as always i want to leave you with a final thought if you don't stand for something you will fall or anything and thanks to surfmeister our vip on patreon and to each and every one of you much love and we will catch you in the next one.